welcome back to my channel. So today I have a pretty large Costco haul to share with you guys. I just got back from Costco. I'm out of breath. Have you ever been to Costco by yourself? It's like nice because you know you don't have the kids running around crazy but also you kind of need help <laughs> putting things in the car and like getting them out of the car. So I'm kind of exhausted but it was well worth the trip because I found some really great things. So we're kind of getting back into our healthier ways. Not completely, don't let me fool you. Like we still love our sweets. But um, we had kind of a weekend where we threw all the food rules out the window, ate everything we wanted, had a good time, whatever. And now it's time to kind of get back on track, put a little fruits and veggies into our bodies. So I found some really great produce items, um, just some fun stuff. So. Keep watching, hit that thumbs up if you like Costco hauls. I will be sharing the prices at the bottom of the screen, kind of how I do on all of my haul videos. And let's just get into this. Okay, you guys, here is our Costco haul. Quite a bit of stuff, y'all, quite a bit of stuff. Costco was crazy this morning. I got there right when it opened and it was so busy. I'm like, what is happening? Okay, so we're just gonna do like our normal haul, start from one and work our way down. I will leave, post the prices somewhere at the bottom of the screen. Here we go. Okay, so first things first, these stone fire um, flatbreads. So my best friend, we went to a play date, she made my kids these little pizzas. Actually, the kids made them themselves, which was even more fun, but they are so good. We just did pasta sauce, cheese, pepperonis, whatever the kids wanted on their pizza, and then you put them in the oven, and my kids love these. So this is an 18 pack. I went to Kroger the other day and bought a four pack and my kids wanted more. So I'm like, you know what, these will last and you can reseal them back up. So we got these, highly recommend. These are the plain and um, we also had some garlicky tasting ones that were really good. So anytime I go to Costco, I pick up these Celsius energy drinks. These are the different flavors. There's orange, um, kiwi guava and wild berry. But they're good. I think they are zero sugar, gluten-free, kosher, non-GMO. So I always try to grab a box of these while I'm there. So we got some healthier items on this haul. We got some bananas. I'm going to make, my body's been craving. I used to have a smoothie every single day. And the smoothie is banana, blueberries, avocado, spinach, and a little water. Sometimes I would put pomegranate juice in it, but water if I want to keep the sugar down. Um, and I've been craving them so bad. And I've been feeling kind of like sluggish and lethargic. So I'm going to get back on to my smoothies. So I got some bananas that we can eat. Some bananas that um, aren't quite ready yet. But they're, you can freeze them once they are ready. If you don't want your bananas to go bad, you can freeze, like peel them and freeze them. Or um, just use, I bought these to make smoothies this week. These for smoothies next week. Also, when you go to Costco, these are my family's favorite cereals, and they are all combined into these two little containers. I got my daughter's Cinnamon Toast Crunch. She loves these. My son loves Fruit Loops. My hubby loves Cocoa Krispies, and I am an Apple Jacks kind of girl. So, fun for the whole family, you know? That's what I love, it's like Costco and Sam's, because they have these little combo deals that you can get to where everyone in your family is happy. Um, I got some plums. My hubby loves to snack on these at night. They look super purple and plump. Costco has the best produce, honestly. The best. So I got these little, these are something I haven't bought before. These little chicken breast bites. They're fully cooked. You can just heat them up or not if you're doing a salad and you want them cold. Um, but I got these for my son because he loves just plain chicken breast, grilled chicken breast. Um, so I got him some of these that he can just kind of snack on or have with his lunch. Maybe some mac and cheese. Um, some strawberries or whatever, super easy. And if he ends up liking these, then I can put these in his school lunch once school starts. You already know these dogs want in. Let's go let them in. The usual interruption. Come on in. Where's your brother? Okay, he's still playing. Now Toby's gonna drink some water and be super loud while we try to do this. Um, so, but these can go in his lunches if he ends up liking them. My son doesn't like sandwiches. Um, so his lunches, I have to make them like a hot lunch, like a mac and cheese or a soup, and I bring it in a thermos. So I'm hoping these would be a nice little alternative. Um, this is the pasta sauce we use. We don't get crazy with it. We, if we do pasta for the kids, I love this one. So we get it from Costco, and it comes in a three-pack. I did grab some of their organic 2% milk. It comes in three half gallons. My kids will go through that very quickly. I end up getting my daughter this promised land chocolate milk. So when school is in session, I will buy her the individual ones so I can throw them in her lunchbox. But during the summer, we save money and we just get it like this. And sis, you can pour it in a cup yourself. Let's 
save a few dollars. So this, she loves this brand too, the Promise Line. She hasn't had it in a while either. Um, I don't know if y'all watched my last Costco haul for June, but yeah, I was, I ended up getting some of these and I wasn't sure how I would like them and I love them. I'm obsessed with them. I will get them every time I go to Costco from now on. This I picked, this is for me. I just, y'all, my lunches and stuff are super simple. I'll do a sandwich. I'll do like a protein shake in the morning, a sandwich at lunch, and then we'll have a bigger dinner. I don't get crazy with it. So I picked up some of these just to do some sandwiches. I'll use whole wheat bread. Um, Put some lettuce and tomato, try to keep it, put some veggies in it and stuff, but I picked this up. I haven't had it, so I don't know if it's any good or not, but it looked good. So that's what we went with. Okay, here's some of our produce that we got to go in our smoothies. Um, well, the strawberries and raspberries are, my kids just will devour these. My son loves raspberries, and look how red they look. They look so good, and they're strawberries. Both my kids love strawberries. I will cut these up, and I will put some fat-free whipped cream on them for a snack, and they will devour it. So, in Costco, their produce always comes in, like, bulkier packaging. So, you get a little bit more, which I love because my kids eat it so quickly. So these are some blueberries I got for my smoothies and some spinach to put into the smoothies. Anytime you can hide some greens in your food without like super tasting it. When I make this smoothie, I don't taste it at all. So I grabbed some um, some spinach. Did I show the fish? Uh, this, we got some fresh Atlantic salmon. And my head, this is for me and my husband. My kids don't eat salmon quite yet. One day they will, I'm sure. But hubby will cut this into four. And this will be like two different dinners for us um, during the week. And he'll grill it or we'll bake it or something like that. But this is, we try to do fish twice a week. So this will be what we do this week. Moving along, moving along. What else do we have? I got some lettuce, you guys. They, Sam, I mean Sam's Costco has these huge romaine hearts um, packaging like you get six of them and i'm going to do some grilled chicken salads maybe for my sandwiches um maybe a caesar salad this week something just to add we need to add a little more vegetables in our food lately we have really been slacking on the veggies and fruits so that's what this haul was about okay then i got some topo chico i love topo chico i will have one of these every single day they are so good at the end of the day just to have that crisp carbonated feeling um, like that. Instead of getting like a Coke or something, I'll grab a Topo Chico. Some grapes, y'all, these grapes are huge. Like, I'm serious. It looks like the size of those plums. Um, these are the organic green seedless grapes. I will cut these in half for my kids. You should always cut your kids' grapes in half. My daughter is 10 and I still cut her grapes in half just because kids can choke easily on these. So, just a you know, little tip. And my son was asking for apples last night and I did not have any. So I went ahead and picked up some of these Honeycrisp apples. You can kind of open their packaging and see what they look like. They look really good. Is it gonna come open? Oh, no. There it goes. Yeah, so you just get a little bundle of apples, great size. My kids love the Honeycrisp. They're what, me too, they're one of my favorites. I got some limes. My husband likes limes. If we do cocktails on the weekend, we'll put some limes in it. Or even with that salmon, we'll squeeze a little lime on it. It's so good. Um, I was running low on my sparkling water, so I wanted to go ahead and pick some up. I got the Waterloo brand this time. Y'all, I'm not super picky when it comes to sparkling water. Some people don't like the Waterloo. I really do like it. I like the bubbly as well. I also like the Perrier. I'm not picky. So, um, But this comes in black cherry, lemon lime, and strawberry. I also got some more cherries. I got these last time. Was it last week I went to Sam's or two weeks ago? I went to Sam's and I picked up some cherries. I got my husband some more. Honestly, we snack on these at night. When we're watching TV, instead of grabbing chips, we'll grab some cherries. Um, and they're so good. And these look really, 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 look at that. How good do this look? Some avocados for my smoothie. I don't know if I mentioned I put avocado in it, but if it's me and my husband, I'll, I'll use a whole one. If it's just me, I'll use a half of one just to get those healthy fats in there. Um, Y'all, I was so excited to find this Panera mac and cheese. I get this at Kroger, and it comes in a little, these are four single serving cups. The ones at Kroger's are a little bigger, but they were, the ones at Kroger are the price of this entire, almost the price of this entire four pack. So my kids love this too. My daughter can make this on her own anytime that she can kind of be independent and do her own thing with her food. I love that. So I went ahead and grabbed some of this. We got two of these organic hard boiled eggs. I'll show y'all how they're packaged. They come in little packs of two. 
as you can see. And me, my son, and my husband love these. We snack on these. I'll put these on top of a salad, on top of avocado toast. My son will just eat these for breakfast. We love them. Could I buy an, a pack of raw eggs and boil them and peel them and put them into individual packaging? Yes but I don't want to. So I just got this one and I got two because we'll go through them for sure. And my son loves corn on the cob. My husband will throw this on the grill for him in the evenings and he'll have some for his dinner. My daughter likes it too. So I ended up getting this eight pack so they can each have a few nights of corn on the cob. And then some squash and zucchini. This comes in like a bag for the both, whoops. My non-healthy item just fell over. Um, it comes in like a, a combo pack. And we do like this really yummy chicken stir fry over rice with this. Um, we use like soy sauce and chicken. We stir it up and then I'll put it over white rice and it's so good. So I went ahead and grabbed this. So now we're kind of coming over here to the some non-food items, but I will show you this. I got one unhealthy item, okay. If you put your chocolate, here's a tip, pro tip. If you put your chocolate next to squash, it's like healthy all in its own. I saw these little Hershey's Nuggets and it was an assorted pack. My kids will have some of these. Hubby will have some after dinner. We'll just have like one to get that sweet craving. Um, you know, after you eat, you kind of want something sweet afterwards. So this one has milk chocolate, milk chocolate with almonds, extra creamy milk chocolate with toffee almonds, and then the special dark chocolate. That's my favorite actually is the dark chocolate. So, oh, and then my son got some Pirate's Booty. He loves this stuff. It's kind of like a popcorn-y corn puff, rice and corn puff little snack. Um, I will open this and put this into individual baggies so that it doesn't go, you know, if he forgets to close it or something. I'll just make it easier and put it into individual baggies for him to snack on. So, I don't know if y'all follow me on Instagram, but I'll put my little Instagram name up at the bottom. I started reading The Nightingale like four days ago or so, and I have finished it. I absolutely, blah, 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 I absolutely love that book. I have never read a book that fast and loved it so much. So highly recommend The Nightingale, but this is the same author. So I, it's called The Four Winds. I kind of read right here to see if it's something that I would be interested to, in, and it sounds really, really good. So I'll have to let y'all know how this one is. Comment down below if you have read this and, and what you think. Comment down below if you read The Nightingale because y'all, that book was so good. I could not put it down. So hopefully this holds up to the Nightingale reputation. I'm excited to try this. Um, I'll probably start reading it tonight actually. So some things, vital protein, y'all already know. If y'all been following me for a while, this is the collagen I put in my coffee every single morning. It was not on sale, like, a, um, I don't know if you follow her, but Our Crow's Nest, she's so sweet. Um, she ha found it at Costco a few weeks ago on sale, which I should have listened to her and went and got it, but I didn't, so I had to pay more today. But that's okay, you, you know, you live, you learn. So I picked some of this up, I put it in my coffee, but I also found this fun little contraption, Orgain Organic Superfumes um Immunity. And you, it's like a powdered form and it's got 50 superfoods, 1 billion probiotics, apple cider vinegar, um, super mushroom blends, vitamin C, D, and zinc. And it's in the flavor honey crisp apple. So I'm thinking about putting a scoop of this in my smoothie and seeing how I like it just to get a little extra superfoods in me because like I said earlier, we have been slacking so much on our fruits and veggies. It's just ridiculous. Um, I found this OxyClean car cleaner. It is in the new car scent. Um, I am going to do a YouTube video soon cleaning my mom car because it is disgusting. It is so, I am so embarrassed. I don't even want to show y'all, but I'm going to. Um, but I found this to use in that video, so we'll see how it works. I'll leave a review when I do that video. Hopefully this week, if this rain ever stops. I don't know. We'll see. Um, I picked up these organic these are healthy hand towels you guys um eight pack kitchen towels these are quite large these are kind of the colors of our kitchen but hubby and me are super picky when it comes to dish towels we have we like the texture you know some can come that aren't like super textured like i think maybe this one right here may not be quite as textured but most of them are so i went ahead and grabbed a pack of these because our dish towels are just getting so grungy so that we, they needed to be some need to be replaced and some we just needed to add to and then last but not least, I found this fun little 
buckle up storage set. It comes with four. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to use some of these in my, there's a spot in our house where we keep the kids' school supplies. They have school supplies that stay at home and then like craft and school supplies. They have school supplies that stay at school and then craft and school supplies that stay home. So when they have homework or if they have a project or something, that was my biggest pickup last year at school was they had all these like projects and stuff and I didn't have anything for them to make stuff with. So I, this year I'm going to stay a little more organized with it. I'm gonna organize their little school cabinet with these, um, with their spirals, books, or whatever, markers, pencils. And so that'll, that'll probably be in a video closer to end of July because I'm gonna do it kind of along with their school supply haul and all that. So, okay, you guys, that is it for the Costco haul. Y'all, it was a very healthy haul. I'm actually proud of myself besides these, but they're sitting next to the squash, so they're kind of healthy. Um, it really isn't that bad. I'm excited to start getting my smoothies again, cut up some of these fruits and veggies for the kiddos to snack on. Hopefully Colton will like these. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching today's haul. And make sure you subscribe, hit that thumbs up, and I'll see you guys on the next one.